Tonight, some big clues into where the jury may stand on the Tex McIver murder case. Tex McIver is accused of intentionally shooting his wife, Diane, outside of Piedmont Park in their SUV. Today, the juror, one of the jurors, asked to take another look at three key pieces of evidence. 11 Alive's Caitlin Ross is outside the courthouse where jurors have stopped their deliberations for the day. Jeff, they actually left a few minutes early. They weren't supposed to be dismissed until 5 o'clock, but about seven minutes before 5, that jury light came on, and all of us reporters flew into a panic, thinking maybe they had reached a verdict, but actually they just wanted to go home early. This is a real sharp left turn from yesterday when we thought the jurors might have been closer to reaching their verdict, but today they really took their time going through that evidence. They looked at emails between Tex and Diane MacGyver, then they re-watched Tex MacGyver's first interview with police. I immediately called out. I said, is everybody all right? And uh, Danny Joe said yes. And Diane, it was kind of slanted. She said, uh, I've been shot, and words to that effect. Okay. And I immediately put my arms around her and tried to determine right. what was. After that, all of the jurors, the entire defense team, Tex MacGyver, all of the prosecution, and all of the media members covering this trial went down to the Sally Port of the courthouse and re-examined the SUV white where Diane MacGyver was shot with the gun she was shot with. The jurors took turns getting in the back seat with the gun and then in the front seat looking back over their shoulders to see what they could see of the gun and the person sitting behind them. The jurors again went home about seven minutes early this morning. They're expecting to come back for 9 a.m. deliberations tomorrow. All right, Caitlin, thank you. To dig even deeper into the trial, including the debates in the jury room, 11 Alive's Vinnie Politan and his legal dream team will be hosting another Facebook Live at 7.30 tonight, a little more than two hours away. You can log on to ask them questions and then let us know what you think the jury will decide.